Okay, welcome to the home gym. Um, so let's start from left to right here. So over on the left, we have got a max strength um, yoga mat. It's technically a crash mat. Um, it's a bit thicker than the yoga mat, which is nice. So I use that for core work. Um, we've got a six foot Olympic barbell. It's 20 kg plus the padding for when I do squats. Um, we've got the, the rack itself. So with the pull up bar at the top, and um, it's got adjustable bars either side. I'm not sure if you can make out the numbers here, but yeah, you can adjust this one for the squats, and then you've got one for the bench press as well. So that's nice. And um, it's just Decathlon's Domios, and it was 150 pound for that. Matching bench here. So again, Domios bench, and um, this was 60 pound. It actually has a few positions on it, so you can go fully flat. Um, let's see if I can move this one-handed, not really. Um, partly up, um, up once more, and then fully upright. So that's useful. Um, we've got the 5kg medicine ball, which we won from an SS Health Foods Facebook competition. It arrived today, so that's nice. Olympic dumbbells, these were just from eBay and they're nowhere near the quality of the barbell. They're a bit rattly and just not that great, but they do the job. Um, so plates, let's have a look, we've got two twenties, two fifteens, two tens, four fives, four two point fives and four one point two fives. And these are grip, which I actually prefer because I can use them as kettlebells in a way as well. Um, so they're handy. The push-up stands. Um, we have actually got two 1.25 plates there, but they're standard. Um, brought them on eBay, didn't read it properly, and they're standard size, so they're only one inch diameter rather than the Olympic two. So then we've got a foam roller and then my protein um, recovery massager, which as you can see, my dog bit the end off. She thought it was one of her toys whilst we were at work. Um, so yeah, we've actually got quite a few of these, which I cannot stand. So they're what came with the barbell and the dumbbells. Um, as you can see, we don't actually use those. We much prefer these. Much easier to get on and off the bar. Makes things a lot faster. And then moving over here. Second hand row machine. Um, I think we picked this up for 15, 20 pound um, off a second hand website. Not the greatest, but you know, does its job for the warm up, cool down. Sometimes if you just want to do a bit of high intensity work up on the rower, the screen actually doesn't work all that well. There's a few, it's an old style screen, so some of the numbers don't work. But hey, for 15, 20 pound, can't really complain. Body power punch bag, um, filled with water, so it's actually pretty heavy, quite tough to move. We're not looking forward to when we have to move that, but there we go. Boxing gloves just behind. Balance board, Domios, so again from Decathlon. Um, doesn't get used as much as it used to, but it is still fun every now and then. Assistance bands, so... These ones I use for assisted pull-ups. Um, just wrap them around at the top of the bar um, to get the pull-ups in. Then we've got five of these ones with the, the hooks here. So these actually can hook on to onto these and you can do rows or pull-downs or any of those movements. Uh, book there as well. Then we've got a whiteboard. So I'll well, write down um, what I plan to do for the session, any weights I want to hit, things like that just to keep me on track. Skipping rope. The mats, um, yeah, only cheap mats. Really I want to flip them because the other side's more of a red, which fits a little bit better, but yeah, it's hard work to, <laughs> to take this apart just to flip the mats, so we haven't done that yet. Um, this bit of carpet was actually, yeah, there's the dog, hi Tess. 
Um, so the carpet was actually in the front room because um, there was no carpet in here at all when we moved in. But as we knew we were going to be putting mats down anyway, we figured we'd just use the carpet from downstairs that we replaced and we spilled the paint on. <laughs> um, we figured we'd just put that in here just for the bit that didn't have mats. So it does go under all of the mat. But um, yeah, there we go. That's the gym. The mirrors. <laughs> Only the one here did actually break. So at the moment it's just balancing against the wall because for some reason this one we actually put it on the wall second but it just won't stay on the wall and yeah fell off and broke poster there and there was actually a treadmill in the other room as well but that room's a bit of a hazard zone at the moment so we won't go in there but yeah there we go we'll hopefully be getting um, a leg extension machine in here leg extension and leg curl Obviously, with everything that's going on at the moment, getting fitness equipment is like buying gold. Um, so, yeah, that's going to have to wait until they've got some in stock. Although we are winning one on eBay, um, but there's still two days left. So hopefully we can win that one and add that to our collection. Um, but otherwise, it'll be probably a few months until we can get anything else in here. Now I have won that one medicine ball. I did use it earlier. Um, and like I said, it's not something I'd think of actually buying because, you know, I've got the dumbbells and we've got all that, all that kind of stuff anyway. But it is actually, it's quite fun doing some squat thrusters with it. And even though it's only 5kg, you do feel it at the end of a, of a tough barbell session. Um, you do start to feel that. So, yeah, I might have to get um, another one of those, maybe 7.5, 10kg. See if we can add that. Um, the squat rack we also do want to replace because the Decathlon have one, again, not in stock at the moment, like any piece of fitness equipment. Um, but they do have one with also um, triceps pull down and the actual machine at the back and just more attachments. It's £350, pounds, um, but that's, that's the one that we're going to be upgrading to. Like I say, once all this is blown over. Um, so, yeah, there we go. That is the gym. Not a big room, but I think we managed to get a fair bit in here. Um, let me know what you think, and if there's any equipment you'd recommend, let me know in the comments section. Thanks, bye.